Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wives official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Mary Brown from Sister Wives has been lamenting the loss of Garrison on social media. She's also feuded with a couple other family members recently. Sister Wives actress Mary Brown is celebrating the life and mourning the death of the late Robert Garrison Brown. The Brown family has shared their lives on the reality series for the past 14 years. Mary was the first wife of Cody Brown, and she functioned as a mother figure for Christine and Janelle Brown's children. Tension among the family grew after Cody married his fourth wife, Robin Brown. Mary has been tremendously supportive of Cody and Robin throughout the years, although Cody arguably destroyed the Brown family. Though they've clashed throughout the years, the Brown family came together after Janelle's son Garrison sadly died. Since his demise, Mary has utilized social media to offer her sorrow for Garrison's passing. Mary recently uploaded a flashback image with Garrison, stating how devastated she was over his loss. Sister Wives followers have defended Mary amid the vitriol she's gotten for using social media to grieve his passing. Mary has been grieving the loss of Garrison, but she's had issues with Christine Brown's son, Peyton Brown, and previous sister spouses Christine and Janelle in the past. Mary's throwback of her and Garrison brought her to tears. She found the photo by accident. Mary sobbed after finding a flashback image of Garrison following his passing. She has been quite open about her grief experience on social media. Mary Ken found the snapshot, which was from 2018, randomly as she was going through her camera roll. A photo I didn't remember I had, and one that I will forever cherish, she wrote. Seeing it immediately moved me to tears, a testament of the love I have for him, the pain of the loss of him. It's a reminder that loss comes in unexpected ways, recollections of the moments with him, all that remains. In Sister Wives, the connections in the Brown family look highly fragmented, Mary's tweets on social media portray an adorable, loving side to the family that viewers haven't seen on Sister Wise in years. The loss of Garrison has stunned the Brown family, and it's good to watch them cherish their memories with him from over the years. Four weeks today without him here with us, Mary added in the post, adding, a lifetime of memories to hold sacred. While Mary's active online, she's been mindful to maintain her family's privacy at this difficult time. Mary hosts regular Fridays with Friends lives on Instagram, where she interacts with Sister Wise followers. Mary hosted a live with her friend Jen Sullivan on March 16, which was around one week after Garrison had departed. During the live, Mary told followers she was not going to answer comments relating to her family. If I talk about it, I'm gonna cry, she confessed, adding that she would not be going into any detail of Garrison's death in respect for Janelle and the rest of her family. Mary Brown was accused of abuse by Peyton Brown. He has been open about their relationship. Christine's son, Peyton, has accused her of abuse. During a YouTube live with John Yates, Peyton told up about his experience being raised by Mary. In response to a comment about Mary potentially being abrasive and kind of mean, Payton verified these statements. Abrasive and kind of mean are not strong enough words, they are not aggressive enough words, Payton remarked, adding how Mary was not nice. Abrasive is not enough of a word to explain what Mary was to a few of us children specifically. Payton further said that the abrasive acts moved so far past verbal. During the YouTube live, Payton cited a battle that began between Janelle's daughter Maddie Brown and Mary in 2019 on Twitter, but the posts have since been erased. However, Soap Dirt posted images of Maddie's tweets regarding Mary that say, try being scared of someone your whole asterisk 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 in life, and she plays like she's the one who's sick, hurting. She was a monster. Payton agreed with Madison's statements. I can reiterate what Madison said about Mary, said Payton, adding, No, we were never safe around her. Payton went on to explain that Robin opened their eyes to Mary's actions. Christine Brown snubbed Mary Brown. She wasn't invited to Christine's wedding. Janelle was the only sister wife invited to Christine's wedding. After Christine left Cody, 
Her connection with Mary changed forever. Christine and Mary have had tension throughout their decades as sister wives, but their relationship virtually terminated after Christine left Cody. Christine told POPL in a joint interview with Janelle that immediately after her separation with Cody, she had spoken with Mary one time and crossed paths a couple of family functions. Christine wasn't expecting their relationship to be so tense after leaving Cody. I thought it would be different, she added, adding, but I don't think it's going to be different than that. Since Christine got divorced, she has remarried to David Woolley. Mary, Robin, and Cody were not invited to Christine's wedding ceremony to David, while Janelle was in attendance. A source said the U.S. Sun disclosed Mary's actual thoughts regarding Christine's wedding. Mary apparently could care less about not being invited to Christine's wedding. Truthfully, she could care less, stated the source. They had a falling out and have been distant ever since Christine left the family and moved to Utah. Since Christine and Mary's relationship had damaged, she clearly had no difficulty not being invited to the wedding. They were never close as sister wives or best friends for that matter, stated the insider, adding, there is no love lost between them. Despite this, Mary still has optimism that they may bridge their divide. It's going to take all parties involved, you know what I mean, she told POPL, adding, but I'm not closing any doors. On Sister Wives, she also confessed she's really happy for Christine and her recent marriage with David. Mary Brown said she was harsh and aggressive with Janelle Brown. Mary has carried resentment for Janelle. The troubles in Mary and Janelle's relationship as Sister Wives started years before Sister Wives season 18 or the show debuted. During the broadcast, Mary admitted she was harsh and aggressive towards Janelle after she got pregnant. Mary was devastated that Janelle was able to get pregnant before her, which went on to strain their relationship. In her conversation with Christine, Janelle noted she lacked the history with Mary and Robin to have as deep a relationship with them as she does with Christine. It's going to stay separate, and I don't need to be close to either of them really, she said. We were all part of a family. We all worked hard when we were part of the same family. But now there just isn't a lot in common. The entire Brown family is grieving the loss of Garrison. Mary has been open on social media about how Garrison's death has affected her life. While Mary has feuded with Payden, Christine, and Janelle in the past, they must support one other in such a difficult moment. Late Sister Wives actor Garrison Brown's final text conversations before his untimely death have been published. What did he have to say, and were they at all telling of his situation? Keep watching for further insights on what he had to say prior to his passing. Garrison Brown's final text messages before tragic death. It was evident that Garrison Brown's family had some concerns about him and his well-being before he died in early March. The 25-year-old apparently shot himself and left a hole in the hearts of all who knew and loved him. More so, the animal world was left weeping as he had just rescued a nine-year-old cat, Miss Buttons. She joined Patches and Cathew in his little family, but he did it so she would not be euthanized. Due to this, supporters gave hundreds of dollars to animal sanctuaries in his honor. Before Garrison died, he was sending off putting messages and then, his mother Janelle Brown, did not hear from him. That was when his brother, Gabriel Brown, headed over to his residence to check on him and found the unspeakable. Garrison had seemingly taken his own life and now his siblings, such as Maddie Brownbrush, are motivated to raise awareness about mental health. On April 9, 2024, In Touch Weekly disclosed text communications between Garrison, friends, and family. I want to hate you for sharing the good times, but I can't. I miss these days, was shared in a group text by Garrison. He had been replying to a paintball fight photo. Additionally, he let someone from his job know that he had been vomiting blood. He stated he was going himself to the doctor and called out of work. Janelle also checked in with her kid, stating he had been on her thoughts all day. Garrison Brown said he was not fine and understood that they concerned about his suicidal tendencies. More so, he had given Gabe his pistols and claimed to not have any firearms in his home.
In one chat exchange, Janelle Brown volunteered to send an Uber for Garrison Brown. She assured him she had a cot for him to sleep on and she would make sure he got there if he needed it. Finally, she requested her boys, Logan and Hunter Brown, to check in on Garrison as she was frightened. She told how he was responding to her but stopped, how he had terrified members of the family with an unusual text, and had called out of work. They tried but, regrettably, it was not enough. Thanks for watching if you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.